Welcome back, everyone. Today is Putting Rochester First Monday, and News 8 has teamed up with the United Way to highlight organizations that help people, especially now during the pandemic. And we are so pleased to be joined now by Charisma Travis, who is the program director of the After School Academy at the Urban League of Rochester. Thank you so much for being here, Charisma. Let's begin with the Urban League. This is an historic organization here in Rochester. They do extraordinary work. Give us a broad sense of what you're doing, the uh, agency's doing. So, um, as my CEO loves to say, the Urban League of Rochester is open. We never close. Um, we currently service over 30, well, we have 30 programs. Um, we have six different divisions in our, so we have a program for everyone, literally, babies all the way up until the elderly, yeah. uh, from development of disability, uh, education, um, workforce development, home store, business development. Job training. Drug family services. Yeah. Um, so yeah, there's a program for everyone. And you you handle uh, the After School Academy. Yes, so I'm the program director over the After School Academy. Um, and then even through COVID, my staff and I have found creative ways to still impact our students. And so even right now, we're just finishing up our first summer cohort. Uh, well, we, we've been meeting with our kids um, for July, and we're going to start our second one in August. Wow. So it's been great. We've been meeting with them virtually, but it's been wonderful being able to still impact those young people. Absolutely. And you know, the need doesn't go away because yeah. the challenges are have increased in this exactly. community. Um, have you found that you're going to be able to successfully continue through the fall or are the challenges sort of mounting for you? So we will continue to um, um, continue through the fall. We just don't know what it will look like. Will it be mm -hmm. in person like we used to be able to do? Will it be a hybrid? Will it be all virtual? So we're kind of waiting to see what the city school district um, decides to kind of figure out our plan. Absolutely. So um, how can Rochester help you at, and and the Urban League carry out this program? Um, I mean, we're always looking for volunteers. So, mm -hmm. you know, if you're open to volunteering, any subject, we're open to that. Um, and also, right now, we actually have our campaign for the Urban League just in general, our in, in, interrupt racism campaign um, to address systematic um, racism, um, uh, power, and equ equity. And so you can go right to ULR. Dot org and learn more information about all our programs, including mine, mm -hmm. and um, about interrupt racism. Um, and if you have any questions whatsoever, you know, feel free to go ahead and log right on. All right, Charisma, <laughs> I wish we had more time. Thank you so much. You've been able to successfully give a really great <laughs> overview for the limited amount of time, and we wish you all well. Thanks so much.